Hello, I'm Tom Kivlin, uh, Principal Cloud Orchestration Architect at Vodafone Group. I'm here with Sridhar and Emma, and we're going to talk about the new Anakut launch, um, merging the CNCT and OpenFE communities to create uh, a new project within the Linux Foundation networking called Anakut. Um, I'm really excited about it. I've been involved in CNTT since uh, inception, sort of helping to develop the reference model. Um, and I've been the workstream lead on the Kubernetes based reference architecture and reference implementations. And uh, I see the benefits to merging with OPNFE to be, to be quite good. Um, obviously the, the end result of the CNTT work streams was to have uh, a, a reference implementation that was able to be tested against the specifications within a reference architecture. Um, and there's a big overlap between many of the OPNFE projects with regards to testing and conformance and, and providing that feedback loop into the architecture specification delivery. Um, and so I'm going to hand over to Sridhar now to talk about the testing projects and um, the benefits the merger has on them. Hey, uh, thanks a lot, Tom. I'm equally excited to be part of this launch of Anukate. Well, uh, when it comes to the OPNFE projects, right, so we have multiple of these projects of which testing are one of the biggest group of projects and they have done excellent contribution to the community as such. And among these testing projects, uh, there are functional, broadly functional and performance uh, testing. And, and uh, I, 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 I work for uh, uh, Spirant Communications and I've, I'm a PTL of uh, uh, one of the testing projects called VSPerf. I also work with other uh, projects like CIRV and Airship. And uh, among these uh, these functional uh, and performance testing projects, right? the performance testing project, uh, they focus on this automation of these test cases that are defined by the specification. The, the specifications play an important role when it comes to the performance testing because they define the importance, the steps and the configuration variables and everything, which are very much important to explain the number that comes along with the performance testing, right? And these testing frameworks implement these uh, uh, test uh, cases that are defined by specifications of which Anuket is one of them. And uh, when uh, with the with the merger this uh, of this OPNFE and CDT, it has streamlined the whole process has been streamlined because uh, we implement the requirements of the Anuket and also the take back of the learnings that we do as part of our projects, especially in VNSP, the experimentations that we do to take it back to the Anuket. So this streamlining has uh, uh, helped us uh, a lot. And I'm very, very excited to be part of this Anuket uh, project. And when, it, when we talk about the performance uh, uh, testing, right? When we want to answer the why kind of questions, uh, the, the significance of uh, the service assurance or the monitoring comes into the picture. I would like to hand over to Emma to talk more about this uh, service assurance. Thanks, Sridhar. Um, my name is Emma Foley. I work as a senior software engineer for Red Hat, where my focus there is on day two cloud operations, which includes metrics and monitoring for service assurance. Um, I'm the um, I'm the PTL for the Barometer project in OPNFE. And uh, for the last few years, uh, we spent time helping to improve the metrics collection tools um, that are available so they're more suitable for NFE. Uh, this includes um, exposing more of the metrics that we need to mo monitor, not only hardware platforms, but also the network and the software applications that are um, very important for NFE. Um, and in terms of capabilities and in terms of working uh, with the CNTT reference architectures and reference models, we know we're not going to suddenly take a large leap overnight in terms of uh, of capabilities and progress is only going to be made by working together through continuous feedback and improvement cycles and i think the um the performance and functional testing tools as well as the monitoring tools we have available are going to be key to this because it will let us continually make sure that the reference implementations meet or exceed the requirements that we expect, uh, not just with functionality, but also, uh, of course, with uh, performance. And these tools are also going to let end users take that reference implementation and evolve it to meet their own needs substitute their own components while still knowing that the performance requirements are being met. 
Um, so I'm looking forward to uh, collaborating uh, with the community um, on improving the monitoring and metrics collection, be it for closed loop automation, for service assurance, or for, again, for performance testing. And I'm looking forward to getting a lot more feedback from end users and closing that loop on requirements and developing um, standards and best, best practices across the industry. Um, I totally agree with your point about the the end users, Emma. I think that that's the purpose of all this is to is to make telco platforms and software more cost effective, so we can we can deliver better customer experience at a lower cost. Um, and I think we've all made the point about collaboration. And I think one of the the key benefits of Anika will be, whilst you know, whilst the projects may not necessarily have had friction between them, just as a TSC being able to come together once a week to make sure there's you know, there's no overlaps, there's no duplication, mm -hmm. there's, you know, people are aware of what, what's happening within the, the, the related projects is going to be of great benefit. Very, very true, Tom. I fully agree with the point, especially the com TSC is coming together, right? It has really helped all this OPNFP uh, project, especially when it comes to the testing. We Now we really know who the end, end users are, end consumers of these test implications implementation, and we are very motivated uh, now so that... Uh, we can meet those requirements specified by Anike. And also, as Emma was mentioning, testing projects are one of the biggest consumers of the service assurance solutions. So we are very happy to collaborate with the other projects and also the CNTT community. Looking forward to it.